do you want to say welcome and stuff? I know you love doing that, doing the stuff that you're supposed to do, those sort of structured things that you're supposed to do on a vlog. Go on, say welcome to this week's vlog, just once for me. I can't. I can't. <laughs> do I have to do it? Yeah. Welcome to this week's vlogs. Oh, f it. <laughs> <laughs> We've got food. Food's turned up. It's amazing. Finally. Claire, how long have we been waiting for this food to turn up? When did we book a delivery? Yeah, but two weeks ago. Two weeks ago. Yeah. What's the date right now? The 22nd of January right yep, now. Yeah, Friday the 20th. Look, we've got two days, right? To eat these raspberries. We've got... It's always the same. Two days to eat these grapes. You, you buy a week's worth of food and you, you, you only have two days to eat it all. No, but I care about getting ripped off. That's just what happens. Listen, unless you go yourself and you rake the back of the shelves and But we and can't. You get... We can't because the kids are doing their schooling at home. Listen, calm down. Okay, okay, sorry. I could still go shopping. I chose to try and get a delivery. But if it keeps happening, then, I, then on a Friday, I'll just have to go out and you'll have to deal with the maths and English. I know, but that's a really bad situation. I the want last my children thing... to learn. Well, no, that, that, exactly. The last thing <laughs> I want my children to be clever. I don't want them to be like me. I think that I think also our situation at the moment, where we don't really have a lot of time to do stuff, explains last week's vlog. <laughs> people thought some people said it was. Shit. Some people said, "Listen, I see what you mean, but it was fine." It and was, some people said it was really good. Yeah, I didn't like it. I didn't like it. I don't think we're good at that sort of structured, let's do this this week. Yeah. Let's play this game. I think what we should do is just stick to taking the camera around with us for a week and just filming hours and hours and hours of footage and then trying to get sort of 10 minutes of entertainment out of it. Yeah. Are you filming me? It's, it's good for sound. No, and it's It's good for sound, Claire. No. Do you think, do you think the microphone will pick up the plastic bags? <laughs> what's well, wrong? That's oh, what's wrong with that? What's happened to that one? It's just been squashed. It got smashed. Catch! Ah! Oh, oh, why was that? <laughs> Catch! Stop! I know you've got another one in your Catch! Yeah. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh, we'll go for a big dog walk tomorrow, I think. Oh, a big one? Big one. Park, big park one? Big park one. Does anybody else say that? Like, taking the dog a walk, like in the morning, is just a walk, but then you go like a big walk. There's a walk and then there's a big walk. Do you want to play Mr. and Mrs. again? Do you want me to do your makeup? <laughs> Are we going to do that thing where we pick each other's clothes? I don't think so, James. Why not? Right, yeah, you're no, actually you supposed to be helping. Whatever, right? I don't oh, know where, go I, away then. I don't know where right. this stuff goes, right. do I? I've never been in this room before. What do you call this room? What's that? Oh. You made that for me? Yeah. Who's that? You. That's me? Yeah. Thanks, you're good mate. Door, didn't you? Did you get some haggis? I've got some haggis. All right. Nice. Oh, blue ribbon caramel. Oh, that's gonna be all sticky. A 24 pack of what's this? It was empty! Get Gary on the phone. Yeah, if anyone knows Gary Lineker or someone with connections, um, they owe me a packet of what's this. <laughs> Is this you helping me put the shopping away? I think it's very clear what I'm doing, Claire. What's that? Getting on my nerves? Not getting on your nerves at all. What are you doing then? Light entertainment. For who? Yourself. Alright, well. I feel like you've got everything under control here. Ah! Uh, oh! Listen! No, in the print! Listen, people have been complaining the last two videos I haven't farted in and I people, don't care. people have been going mental. So there was a little fart. First of all, they're not going mental. They are. They're and secondly, did I Did you see what they did outside the White House? <laughs> <laughs> that was because there was two videos of ours that didn't have farts in and they kicked right off. 
You've got to go to Aldi. Aldi don't deliver. Do you oh. want me to risk getting coronavirus just so you can get your cheap thrills? It's not an orange, is it? I know, but whether it's big or wee or whatever, it's a big orange and a wee orange, it's an orange. It's a Clement's one. Right, well you can start taking rubbish out then. Come on. If you fart, I'll kill you. James, don't you dare! What are you doing, Claire? Got to change the sign. Yeah, thanks for all the suggestions on what we should write on our chalkboards. There was only one that we could really go for. It was the overwhelming. It was, uh, yeah, it was suggested by a lot of people. Is that straight? Yeah, that's alright. Scum. Friday evening, cheeky little curry. Mm hmm. We've had a nice evening, haven't we? It's been quite nice. Yep. Claire's, Claire's making us watch this, which is uh, Real Housewives of New Jersey. You literally begged me to put this on. I didn't. I wanted to watch that film, and, uh, and then you said, what if it's rubbish? And I went, well, we can just put some housewives on then if you want. Yeah. Oh, James. <laughs> Oh my god! One of my favourite things is just to dip poppadons in sauce. I love it. What? Just nice. Just makes me happy. Nice simple thing. People say I'm a pussycat, but I've got claws. And that would have been, that's perfect for, that would have been great on The Housewives. Maybe when I watched The Sopranos and then I just could not say, just stop saying, saying Maron. Yeah, you weren't even saying it ironically. <laughs> no, I'm... Just like you drop something you go, oh Maron. <laughs> but it was just in my vocabulary for a while after The Sopranos. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you something that I do want to actually talk about last week's vlog. Oh Maron! <laughs> Let it go! No, I just, I just want to dip back into the comments. A lot of people slagging me off. Oh yeah, they were, yeah. A lot of people slagging me off because of my uh, favourite Bond. Yeah, there is was. Is Timothy Dalton. Mm-hmm. I love Licence to Kill. I love The Living Daylights. I love Timothy Dalton. He's my favourite Bond. Yeah, you were getting some heat for that. Getting some heat, yeah. All right, out of interest, who's your favourite Bond then? Let me know in the comments. And there's no wrong answer. Do you know yeah. who my favourite Bond is? It's got to be Connery, surely. Yeah. Yeah. He's my second favourite. Well, Pierce Brosnan is up there for me because he was the first Bond that I saw. Goldeneye? Um, no. The word is not enough. I don't know what it's called, but I can tell you what happened. Um, it was like ice, and then he had a car that went invisible. Yeah, I watched them all again recently last year, and even that one with the invisible car, when mm -hmm. even when I was a kid I was watching it, I was going, oh, you've gone too far here. It actually, has aged quite well. But yeah, let me know. Who's the best Bond? Surely there's been one of those bloody ITV programmes who the best Bond. Who, who always comes out on top? Connery. Connery. Yeah. We've got a picture of him in our kitchen. We do. I We've had that, that picture, picture for years. So much. Such an iconic picture. Do you know where I got that picture? Go on. b and Q. Really? Yeah. I was just doing him one of my, you know, my usual b and Q. Remember you thought I, I was having an affair with somebody who worked at B&Q? Because I was just always at being here. Never got to the bottom of that. <laughs> I just, I love being here. I could do some Neil Diamond for you. Go on. Pretty soon we were taking it serious. Me and you underneath the mysterious spell. Neither one of us taking the middle ground. That is a perfect impression. Is it? Yes! I can feel it! I can feel it! Look at you. Look how impressed you are. <laughs> oh, I've got some... You know when you're like... Oh, listen, come on. You need to get something up. Look who you're talking to. But that just reminds me of that Matthew McConaughey thing. Mm. What was it he did? Mm. Mm -hmm. I've only watched Wolf of Wall Street one once. I need to watch it again, I think. I watched it twice. Me and you watched it once. And then I watched it not long ago. I watched it like a few weeks ago. I had a load of ironing, like a ton of ironing. It's a good film to put on. What was it, about three hours Yeah, or it was like three, and I thought, right, pick a long film, 
and then just that's that's my trick to getting ironing done i keep getting older and those high school girls they stay the same age he did see it what film was it dazed and confused that's what i love about these high school girls man i get older they stay the same age all right all right all right Honda. You all right? She'll pull me, oh, I'm gonna slip over. She's gonna pull me over. But it's a lovely, beautiful, sunny day. We've decided to take the dog on a big walk. Right, let's go and fall over in the mud. Come on, boys. Oh, yay. Let's go. It is really wet. Really gross. Oh my God. James, you get the poo bags, yeah? Oh, she found a big stick. You found a stick? Oh no, see, you're wrapping me up, Paisley. Paisley! Oh my God. She, look, she's wrapping me up. I want to see Dad slip. <laughs> yeah, we all do. Because it'd be funny. You okay, Judy? No. Oh my God, how have you managed to get it up your leg so quickly? I don't know. You even treat her like she's some sort of criminal or something. <laughs> yeah. And I've got to be honest, I get, I genuinely get really offended by it. Yeah, it is it's annoying. It's like a sort of, whoa. Oh. <laughs> it's a sort of case of discrimination. <laughs> she's fine, she wouldn't do anything to anyone. Because she's a Rottweiler, she she does get discriminated against in people in the park who people have like they grab their dogs and they go oh yeah no fair enough like some people don't like bigger dogs maybe some people have had bad experiences fine but it's every time every time we're at a park that happens to us i'm sure other owners of rottweilers alsatians that sort of big breed dog might experience the same thing Paisley! Here she is! There she is! She got. Come on, come on. Wow. Come on, this way. Whoa, whoa. Dude, what have you found here? A swimming pool for the ants. Swimming pool for the ants? What is it? It's like a... It's like, I think it's like a, a bubble. Is there water coming out of the ground? The water apocalypse have started. The water apocalypse? Yeah. Oh Always. no. That's Soon bad in the future. Soon in the future. All of it would be flooded. Tsunami. I don't know what that is. It's like a whirl, whirl hole. If anyone knows what that is, the spring, is that, that's not how that works, is it? The water apocalypse has started! Run! Maybe it would take out the other apocalypse that's starting. What's the other apocalypse? I can't say, because other YouTubers don't say it. Did they say this, though? Ah! Just 
check to see if there's anyone around me. No, got away with it. Film what? Wait, are you filming? No. What do you not want to show me? How wet my bottom is. I want to, <laughs> I want to see what happened to the back of your trousers. What? Oh, it's a little bit. <laughs> is that definitely mud, yeah? Oh, Jude, you haven't. Did you? You haven't pooed your pants, have you? No, I haven't. On YouTube? Oh no. You said that you weren't filming. <laughs> Quite muddy here, isn't it? What is this? Ba 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 She doesn't okay. like the water. It's yes, Jude. They were testing the fences for weaknesses. They remember. What? Ba 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 ba. I wonder if the microphone's picking up all the wind. It shouldn't do, because we've got. <gasps> Please get it, please get it. Wow! That's your coolest walk, Jude. 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 Yeah. Jude. Come on, please, boys. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you got? What are you got? Can we grill it? Please. What are you got? Yeah? You appear when you're rubbish. You know there's a wheelie bin out here, James, that it can go in. There we go. Stains yeah, right I know. on your nipple. I, know. <laughs> I thought it was a piece of dust or something, so I went like that to get it off. It was a bit of um, chocolate from a cookie. And I smushed it into the fabric. And on that bombshell, this is the end of this week's vlog. Thanks for watching it. If you did enjoy it, why not give us a subscription, uh, turn on the notifications so that you're bugged every time that we put something on the internet. The garden's getting tidied up on Friday, hopefully I'll be able to barbecue over the weekend. Uh, for those of you that were uh, interested, we now have heating. Well, it feels like it anyway, it feels yeah. like we've got heating downstairs in our house. Which is great, just keeping you up to date really with the stuff that's going on in our life. Got to sort the fire out. Sort the door handle out so that we can use the kitchen door again. Peasley! Stop! You told people about that one? No, I don't think I have. We've got a door that we just can't open and shut. <laughs> <laughs> it's the kitchen door. There's two doors to the kitchen, one of them you can't go through. And it would be nice to be able to go through that door. Yeah, but you know what they say? Go on. You only need one door per room. I've got a feeling that that's going to be going up on the blackboard <laughs> next week. Thank you for watching. We're, we're gonna, we'll leave you now. We'll get out of your hair. You can go back to doing whatever it was that you were doing. I do appreciate the view. Tell your friends. Check out At Home With The Buckleys. Maybe not, actually. Why? I don't know. They might. You know what it's like when you meet friends of friends. We'll just keep to the people we've got. Yeah, I think so. All right.
Don't tell anybody then. Yeah, don't tell anyone about this. Just let's just keep it. Just um, us. Just us. Just us lot for now. <laughs> um, but before I go, let me just do this for you. All right, you done? I'm done. Bye.